Welcome to Drainage Sales and the PBSL Group. As you can see, we're a major stockist of land drain and ducting. And one of the questions we get asked most about land drain is how to make a connection, how to join it either to other land drain pipes or to 110 mil drainage. If you're using the land drain to drain a small garden, it's quite likely you won't need a coupler, you'll get away with just one coil. But if you do need to join uh, longer lengths together or perhaps create a pattern of land drainage in your garden, you will need to know how to make the connection. 100 mil land drain, if you buy it in 50 meter or 100 meter coils, it comes with one plane end and one coupler attached. That's not true of 60 mil and 80 mil, they're always plane ended. So if you do need to join those sizes, you need to buy a loose coupler. Now I say a loose coupler for a reason, and that's because it's just a simple push fit. You literally just push it into the ribs like so and give it a twist. Do the same with the other end and that's the join made. We call it a loose joiner because there's no need to have a seal. There's no need for a rubber seal in this coupler because there's no foul drainage involved here. It's just harmless surface water. So it doesn't matter if a little bit leaks out and it also allows a little bit to leak into the pipe and flow away with the rest of your land drainage. Loose couplers are available in all sizes of land drain. If you're connecting your land drainage into a rigid drainage pipe, just use a standard 110 drainage coupler and the land drain coupler is a good fit. We'll go straight in and your pipe will go in the other end. Again, makes a nice watertight seal, but like I said earlier, it doesn't have to be, but that's the complete job. If you're installing land drain in a larger area, the usual way to do this is to form the land drain in a herringbone style pattern with a central drain down the middle and branches coming in. On those branches, you would use a Y junction, and this one is actually a multi-junction and it allows connection to different sizes. So we've got the 60 mil there, the 80 mil there, and the 100 mil there, and you just cut the size down to show whichever one you need. So if we're using this fitting in conjunction with a 60 mil land drain, already comes with the 60 mil open already. So we just push the 60 mil straight inside and make the connection. But if you want to use it with the next size up, 80 mil, we would cut it on the 80 mil lug, and I've already done that. So here's a section that I've cut away. So I've just cut that with a standard hand saw, just pulled that top off. That's left me with an 80 mil opening, which will now go straight onto 80 mil land drain. And obviously it's exactly the same uh, purpose for 100 mil. If you need 100 mil, you just cut back to the 100 mil line and push the 100 mil land drain straight inside. So it really is a multi-use connector. If you have any further questions about land drain installations, do take a look at our website, www.drainagesales.co.uk. There's a lot of information there, or please contact us and we'll try and help you out. Thanks for watching, we'll see you again soon.